48 short boxes. This is part two. We're going through boxes five through eight. All right, guys, this is part two of 48 short boxes. We're going through each and every book in each and every box. We're going through boxes five through eight. Before we get into it, hit me up on all the social medias. You know where I am, Barry Gary underscore comics. Down below, there's discount codes for Mutant Beaver Comics, cover price, and whatnot. I, I got nothing else. Why don't we just get right into this? I'm sure there's something I'm missing. But uh, oh, in the description down below also is a link to part one if you missed part one and you want to watch that one first and then come back to this one. No rhyme or reason. You can watch them in any order, but if you don't want to miss anything, part one first, then two, three will come out in a uh, week or so. I don't know. Let's 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 dig through these boxes. All right, we got to take four more boxes off the stack. We're going over here. Uh, yeah, this is gonna this is gonna take a while. I don't know what we're looking through. Oh, there's a note on this one. X Files. I don't like that. All right, here we go. Next boxes. Four more. Let's dig into it. This one says. Really random assorted number ones, unless I'm reading that wrong. Really random assorted number one, Sin City and the Shadow. Sin City could be interesting, but I don't know if anyone even cares about those books anymore. But we'll see what we have. Ugh. Ugh. A lot of bags. No boards. Sin City. So hopefully, I'm going to have to go through all the Sin City stuff. Hopefully put sets together. Entire sets uh, is anyone looking for, uh, Dracula from Topps Comics? No? No? Me either. All right. Here's the shadow. I don't know if anyone's really into the shadow, so I gotta move this a little bit like that. Uh, I don't think anyone's into shadow. I don't know if anyone's into spirit. Instant Plano. I don't know what that is. Instant Plano? Oh, piano, <laughs> right? That's piano. Yeah, I, I, I imagine that's piano because Plano makes no sense and I'm dumb. All right, Justice, this is M, Blood, a, a Tail. See, a lot of this, oh man, the Jaguar, major keys here. The Comet, Impact comic stuff here. Impact comic. Oh, there's a Hulk book. We got a Marvel book. Hulk smash number one, number two, and that's it. Back to Vertigo, Rifle Brigade. Yeah. What do we have here? Oh, this Johnny Homicidal Maniac. We're going to have to look. We're going to pull that. I don't know if that's his first appearance or not. We're going to pull this. Uh, you know, I'm just going to look these up. See, it's a lot easier when everything's in order. I could just put it in boxes and then go back. When things were out of order, like the last collection, uh, that makes it a lot harder to go back and find the books you're looking for. So I'm going to keep a lot of this stuff together. Unless I know for a fact it's a major key, I'm going to, I'll go back then, you know, I'll pull it. I wonder if this is the first Buffy. It might be. Let me pull that one. Oh, we have a whole lot of Buffy here. Two, three, oh, that's, nope, that's all the buff we have. The hacker files. Well, that was assorted, I'll tell you that. Okay, very little Sin City. I was expecting, like, half this box to be Sin City because there's so many miniseries, so many sets, so many runs of it, but lo and behold, no. Let's get to box two. All right, I'm not really expecting much out of this one. Book of Magic, Starman, Conan. Uh, I'm I, I'm almost positive it's Dark Horse Conan, not Marvel. If it was Marvel, I'd be hoping to see those last issues because I don't think he would have the first, but we'll see. I could be wrong. Book of Magic. Could definitely be wrong. There might be some Marvel. Here's Starman. Let me pull out a bunch of this Book of Magic stuff. I don't know if anybody cares about Book of Magic. Books of Magic. And then I think it changed titles. Uh, look at all this book of fairy Starman. Again, I'm gonna have to go back and do a little research on this. See if there's any key. This is Shazam, Starman. He had a Shazam snuck in there. The Shazam kind of looks like Starman. See why we could do four boxes compared to last last year. All right, here's Conan. We have Dark Horse Conan. Zero issue zero issue one. Uh, 
Let's see, let's see, let's see. All Dark Horse Conan. All Dark Horse. Yeah, this is all Dark Horse. Oh, there's a Red Sonia. Let me see if... Some more Red Sonia. Some more Red Sonia. Red Sonia number one. But I don't know if this is her first number one with Dynamite. More Conan. All right, let, let's get to... I'm going to have to do some research again. Let's get to box number three. All right, here's box number three. X-Files Star Wars, which is Dark Horse. We like that big time. Uh, Next Men trade paperbacks, some Valiant stuff. We'll we'll see. Okay, all right. Let's pull out the trades. The Next Men trades. There might be a tiny little itty bitty value in that because I can't imagine a ton of people were buying those. Let's pull this giant thing of trades out. This is Unity Saga one through four. Okay. Now let's start digging. All right, Unity. Let's see. Can you see all right there? Let's go down a little bit more. There we go. Eternal Warrior, Archer. Bunch of number ones from Unity. Here's Valiant. Oh, boy. Oh, I like this. This is the pro number one. This is by Pamiati and Connor. Garth Ennis on this book, too. Uh, this is an awesome read. Not a lot of value in here. This went through multiple printings. Uh, let me see. This looks like a first print. I'm going to pull that aside. I have that book signed by Pamiati and Connor. It's, it's a fun read. It's just a Pilgrim. Just a Pilgrim, other stuff. Babe, number one. See, some of this stuff I really just have to look up. I'm not positive about some of this. But I know this collection has some Marvel DC stuff. I know it. That's a little erotic. Here's some Marvel Knights. Superman first. Blade of the Immortal. Yeah, no. That's manga. Ghost in the Shell's second series, it looks like, right? We'll have to look that one up because I imagine it's all here. Dominion. Some of this Dark Horse manga stuff. You never know, man. Dominion, Dominion. Here we go. Oh, too bad it's the trade. Oh, it's Star Wars Classic from Dark Horse. We'll still pull it. We'll pull it out because look at it all. Might have a run. Oh, here you go. Tales of the Jedi. I like this. One, two, three, four, and five. So we have the full Tales of the Jedi run. I like that. And more X-Files. More X-Files. Didn't we see X-Files in the last box? No. Last video? No, we didn't see X-Files. We saw... Yeah, no X-Files. This is... Oh, boy. This is like the whole run, huh? A lot of X-Files here. Okay, let's get to box number four. All right, box four. Ooh, and it looks pretty. All right. Okay, what do we have in here? I like pretty. Oh, we have Jonah Hex. We have some Justice League, New 52 Justice League, Star Science, Jonah Hex, 43, 44, 45, 46. All right, we're starting here with Jonah Hex. Okay, let's see how much Jonah Hex we have in here. 54, 55, 56. Let's jump around. 66. Okay. All-Star Western. So more Jonah Hex from the new 52. And that keeps going all the way to 34. I don't know if... Oh, that's the end of the run. And then City of Demons. This is some Hellblazer stuff. Uh, more Hellblazer stuff. Yeah, more Hellblazer stuff. Issue 270. You know, there's another box with Hellblazer in it, so I'm going to have to make sure I keep everything aside. Imagine having a full, giant, complete Hellraiser run. Hellraiser? What? Hellraiser. My God. Hellblazer. What is... My mind is, is mush here, getting ready for New York Comic Con. Shade. And then what do we have after Shade? We have... Special preview to Earth One. More preview. Oh, that's an interesting preview, isn't it? New 52. Kirby Genesis. Let's pull this out. Ooh. Oz Primer. Spider-Man Saga. Sneak Peek. Books. 
And maybe that Miles sneak peek book will be in here. Marvel Point One variant. That's a cool one. We'll definitely pull out. Ultimate Fallout 4 second print. We'll pull that. That's nice. Defenders. Arrow number one. Marvel Now. Fear Itself. Okay, so this box actually wasn't too bad because we got a couple nice books there at the end. And let's talk about what we found in these four books. Bought four boxes. All right, nothing too, too crazy, but I promise you this collection does take a turn for the better. A, a lot, like I talked about in part one, a lot of indie stuff, a lot of obscure titles, a lot of reading material in here. Long runs, great stories, not a tremendous amount, tremendous amount of value. But what we pull out of here, that Johnny Homicidal Maniac, this is actually a fourth printing of this book. The first printing is the most expensive. This is really high grade though. I'm probably not going to send it to CGC. Buffy the Vampire Slayer. This one is not too, too much unless I, you know, looked it up the wrong way here. Marvel Point One, number one variant. Nothing too crazy here. Ultimate Fallout 4, second print variant. Again, nothing over the top insane. Nice books. The Pro, I love this book. Just another great story. I think it's like a $10 or $20 book. I'm not, I'm not positive. And then that Tales of the Jedi 1 through 5. Not a crazy expensive mini series. But what this does is give us hope that later in boxes we can find some really good Dark Horse Star Wars stuff. I think we found Dark Horse Star Wars stuff in part one. And now we found it again in part two. So maybe, hopefully, down the line, we find some really cool stuff. Maybe some Ahsoka, um, maybe some Thrawn. I don't know. We'll see. You know, I, I went through these boxes very quickly You'll see, and, um, at the guy's house, and I haven't gone through it since. And here we are. So that's it for me. Thank you guys for watching part two. Part three will be out before you know it. And as always, keep it comics.